students today we are going to learn what comes between so since all of us are now well versed in forward and backward counting we will learn what comes in between so what comes in between means what number will come in between the two numbers for example if we take these three numbers that is 1 2 and 3 so number 2 will say i come between 1 and 3 it always works in the set of three numbers okay it can be 1 2 3 it can be 2 3 4 or 3 4 5 and in every time what we will write the number coming in the center if we take 2 3 and 4 which number is coming in the center yes 3 is coming in the center so what three will say three will say i come in between 2 and 4 so is it clear number 2 will come between 1 and 3 number 4 will come between 3 and 5 number 6 will come between 5 and 7 let's take another three combinations that is 8 9 and 10 the number of the set of three combinations okay so what happens here which number is in the between yes number 9 is in between so number 9 comes between 8 and 10 let's jump to the worksheet to see if we are able to solve the questions so here it is a dash 2 dash 4 that is again a set of three numbers what number will come between 2 and 4 see in the number line 2 3 and 4 which number is in the center 3 and 3 is missing from here so what we will write yes we will write number 3 okay now next question next question is 7 dash 9 7 8 9 that means 8 will be coming here now again we have our three numbers 5 dash 7 This is five. This is seven. Which is the number in between? Six. Six is missing from here. Yes, we will write six, eight, nine, and ten. Is it correct? Okay. Now let's take some bigger combinations. Fourteen dash fifteen. We all know the forward counting, right? So let's count from fourteen. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. What we will write here? Fifteen. What comes between twenty and twenty-two? Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. What we will write? Twenty-one. Thirty, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. What you have to do exactly? You have to just count a number after this. That is, if you see forty-four, what you will do? You will count from forty-four. Forty-four. Forty-five, forty-six, right? So I should write here forty-five, since forty-six is already written. Eleven, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen is here. Eleven is here. What should we write? Twelve. Then twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. If you can't remember after twenty-four, then you should start by twenty, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Twenty-three, twenty-four. Twenty-four is here. Now be alert. Twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Twenty-six is also here. So what is missing? Twenty-five. What should we write here? Twenty-five. Similarly, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. Thirty-four is here. We have to be alert. Thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six. Thirty-six is also here. What should we write here? Thirty-five. Okay. Now you have to solve the worksheets. Okay, learn counting properly and solve the worksheets. Also learn about what comes after, before, and between. Don't get confused. Okay, and the one-stop solution to not get confused is lots of practice. 
सो वॉट यू हैव टू डू यू हैव टू प्रैक्टिस अ लॉट ओके ऑल द बेस्ट